There's a lot of scenes of Game of Thrones that are filmed in Spain. I think Gabriela. What? <laughs> hey, have a good day at school, you guys. Bye. Sevilla, Malaga, Granada for the weekend. So, can't wait to show you guys. See you later. All right, so already after a couple of hours of driving, we're in Cordoba, so uh, that's our first stop today. We're just gonna stop here to grab something to eat. From the outside, it looked a little bit like a suburb of Madrid. Hey guys, do we have an idea where we're going? No. We're eating at a small place called La Alqueria. If we're still hungry. Yes. Big gang bang. What are you saying? Speak English! What the fuck? This is the Italian bridge. This bridge takes us to another very beautiful building right there. We didn't see many tourists around the city, but obviously near monuments like this one, like the Italian bridge and um, the building we're just about to go see right now. Probably gonna see more people. This arc is like actually the entrance to a church now. What time is it? What time are we supposed to be in Malaga? Four o'clock. Welcome to our second destination of the day, Malaga. Still some sleepy heads in the back. We're missing the sunset and we have to be at the top. Trying to take an elevator to get that to the top. It was one heck of a walk, but we finally made it. Guys, look at this. The view and the time of day. Officially in our first Airbnb, we're going Directly to sleep. Rise and shine. Saluta i follower di Omar. Saluta i suoi iscritti. Un gros bisou de la team depuis Sevilla, la cathédrale. It's surprising to see that such architecture already existed five or six hundred years ago. We're going up to the tower. We're still going up. Almost there. Look at this view, guys. Just to let y'all know, this is the tower in which we were earlier, me and Davide and our other friends. Now we're in the courtyard of the cathedral. There's a lot of scenes of Game of Thrones that are filmed in Spain. So for the fans of Game of Thrones, Real Alcazar is really a place to visit and that explains the queue that we're seeing right now. Um, a lot of scenes of Dorne and uh, House Tyrell have been filmed here. Look at this beauty, this is the garden. We parked the car about like five minutes walk from the house because there's no parking near it. Granada is no joke, it's freezing in here. We bought some food, put it in the oven, and just hoping it's gonna be edible. That's all we're asking for, we don't want it to be good, just something that doesn't poison us to death. They say it takes something near three hours to see everything you need to see inside the Alhambra. We have to go see, it's an Arabic neighborhood uh, near Alhambra. Right now I'm right next to the cathedral and obviously there's a big plaza and that's something that is very common in Europe. We've seen this with the cathedral in Malaga as well. So people gather around and uh, just hang out next to the cathedrals. Right now we're on the other side of the chain of mountains and we can clearly see Al Umbra from here. Al Baisin, the city in which we are right now with that blue and white pattern similar to Shefshawan, is actually declared World Heritage Site since 1984. These houses are carved inside the mountains. Just dropped the car. And Home sweet home. It was a long weekend. We were on the road numerous hours. We're finally back. So I met a new friend today and uh, he's been telling me all about Ephesus and how big and illustrious this city was. Asian library. It was three stories high. It was the biggest top three in the world.